Dear students, today I am going to teach first assignment of introduction to civil engineering profession. First question, choose the correct option from the following statements. So he has given four statements. Civil engineering was a term started by back as contrast to engineers who worked for military. So obviously this is a correct statement civil engineering was a term started when concrete buildings are built wrong civil engineering started when infrastructure projects were built wrong civil engineering was a term when cement was invented it is a wrong generally the term civil engineering was established by John Smeaton in 1750 to contrast engineers working on civil projects with the military engineers who worked for ornaments and defenses who worked for ornaments and defenses so only statement one is correct answer a for question number one what is the role of a civil engineering obviously a b c d e so obviously planning first of all and then designing and then execution after complete construction during intermediate maintenance so these are all the role of civil engineering so answer e for question number two question number three what are the parameters considered for optimization of construction projects so generally optimization means minimum time minimum cost minimum resources resources two types human resources men material equipment okay so time cost raw material human resources equipment so answer c for question number three question number four which of the following disciplines of civil engineering deals with soil interaction and design of substructure so substructure is this is a ground below ground the structure is substructure above ground the structure is superstructure substructure will be inside the earth so Water resources deals with water bodies. Environmental engineering deals with water supply and waste water collection. Geotechnical engineering deals with soil interaction with structures. Construction management, it is execution of construction projects. So, soil interaction and the substructure design was dealt by geotechnical engineering answer c for question number four five question the facade of burj khalifa in dubai is made up of the following material obviously the facade of burj khalifa is constructed by glass answer b for question number five coming to question number six what is the design life of Burj Khalifa? Burj Khalifa design life is 100 years and its height is 828 meters, 160 stories. It is world's tallest structure. World's tallest structure. Okay, so answer A for question number 6. Who is called Einstein of Structural Engineering? 
so generally fulzur khan fajlur khan fajlur rahman khan especially full name he is called he is a bangladeshi american he is a structural engineer and he is an architect for his innovative use of structural systems like skyscrapers for innovation and design of skyscrapers and construction he was especially called as einstein of structural engineering okay so answer b for question number 7 question number 8 environmental engineering deals with so generally environmental engineering deals with water supply from sources to the house and wastewater collection from house to the outside areas that is protection and improvement of environment it is correct management and optimization of resources in the built environment execution of environmental laws so answer d for question number eight question number nine what is our uses of scaffolding scaffolding it will support temporary of a structure temporary platform to the support of a labor a structure which carries machines a temporary platform to keep materials so temporary support of a structure so all this sometimes it will also carry machineries so these are all the uses of all the above answer these are all the uses of scaffolding coming to question number 10 which of the following is not use of building a dam generally to generate dam uses or flood control irrigation navigation recreation and to store water generally it is not compulsory to construct a dam so a for question number 10 coming to question number 11 the main advantages of construction of bandra worli sea link so obviously bandra worli sea link it is rajiv gandhi sea link and it is 5.6 kilometer and it is eight lane in mumbai it reduces travel time sea link attracts tourists and it is longer life longer design life due to use of silica fume okay so this is the main advantage a b and d these are multi select questions you need to tick for all and here for this question a structure which carries machineries so scaffolding will not carry machineries a b d are the answers and 12th civil engineering disciplines deal with design of earthquake resistance structure so generally structural engineers will deals with the design of earthquake resistance geotechnical it is soil urban planning it is towns and developed areas concrete technology is mixed design of concrete so structural engineering deals with design and uh, design for earthquake resistance structure so it is answer b for question number 12 question number 13 what is a built environment so built environment means man-made structures that is it is not or naturally available these are all man-made structures features and facilities viewed collectively as an environment in which people live and work is called built environment okay so the space which is created by humans is nothing but it is a built environment b for 13 
September 15th is celebrated as Engineers Day in India as a tribute to which the following person. So it is September 15th Engineers Day from 1968. Government of India announced the birth anniversary of Moksha Gundam Vishweshwaraya will be celebrated as Engineers Day from 1968 September 15th. Okay, so Sri Sir Moksha Gundam Vishweshwaraya. And coming to last question of the assignment, identify the structure in the picture. So obviously it is a lotus temple which is located in New Delhi and architect. You need to remember, they will ask in the final exam. Fari Borj Sahba is architect he is an iranian he is belongs to iran so answer a for question number 10 15 thank you